What is up everyone, my name is Jesse, this is The Auditorium. I react to video game music as a musician myself. This is a Patreon Platinum request for your average metalhead, a new game on the series, Catherine. And the song is called It's a Golden Show. I've never heard of this game. Don't know anything about it. But upon looking at the information here in this YouTube video, provided by Remix Robots, composer Shoji Maguru. Well, I kind of wish I didn't see that, just so I don't have like some expectations, but I couldn't help it. So, Shoji Maguro from Persona. Either way, this is Catherine. I don't know what this is. It could just be a whole new sound, but uh, I'm kind of I'm biased towards this composer. He's pretty damn good. Let's go. This might be the intro movie of the game. What a interesting visual. A little bit of a ballad. That was sick. That was sick. Okay, I, I, the way the strings just disappeared. Oh my god. Oh, and it's catchy too? Shoji is crazy. This dude puts a lot of effort into his songs. Like the, the mixing and mastering quality. What is this image by the way? That's, that's, that's the stuff right there. Reminds me of like 70s funk. Oh man, that horn section is killing me. I love how the piano chords are just going the whole time. And then everything else around it is just kind of grooving with it. This is a total groove. It's a jam. You could play this for hours and hours and hours. I love this. Simple. This is so catchy right here, the second part. Bum, 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 bum. You're probably singing it already. I'm down to hear another loop or not. I think there's one more loop. Bring it on. What a, oh man, this is so good. Oh, the organ! I just noticed the organ. 
It's just copying the piano. Oh, that's so cool because it turned down. One more before it fades out completely. You know, I'm a very lucky person. I already know that. It wasn't always that way. I've, uh, you know, I've struggled. <laughs> My life has had a lot of uh, ups and downs, mostly downs. But it's been, you know, it's been pretty good the past year since this whole thing has taken off. But the fact that people just share these songs with me because it makes them happy. I can only imagine the feeling of like showing it to someone else and seeing their face light up knowing it's making them happy because I know what that feeling is like. I pretty much have made a channel based on one of the coolest feelings ever. Every time you show a friend, hey, listen to the song or something, you want to see the reaction, right? You want them to go like, oh yeah, or something, or what is this? this you know, you want something, validation. My whole channel basically is validation to thousands of people. This song is great, and you know I've I've had a good I've had a good streak. You know I don't get a lot of bad music on the channel, but but today in particular has just been Chef's Kiss. This was so simple. It's just a, it's just a simple simple jam. A jam track meaning like a, it's like the same thing over and over and over and over, and then like a group will like improvise over it because it's just the same uh, chord progression, you know. I don't know where to start. I'm like jumping around subjects here. I really love the horn section. I really love every instrument, to be honest. Everything sounded really, really crystal clear. Shoji is very... I, I want to say he's like even meticulous with mixing and mastering. I don't know if he does it, but... You know, he, he takes care of the product. You know, whether it's Persona or here. And that's another thing, too, is I was I was kind of fearful it might sound like Persona. And, you know, to some it might, but I've, I've now listened to a, a handful of Persona music. And I don't think that sounded like Persona, I think it sounded like its own thing. I don't know what Catherine is, but... I don't know. It's just... It was simple. It was just... Just a, a jam, 70s funk track. Catchy as hell, right? It's just that little horn section. And if I recall correctly, Shoji is like primarily a guitar player. So it kind of just shows like his palette, which is quite impressive. I don't know if he writes other stuff too. Either way, either way, dude's just impressive. I can't talk about him enough. Like he, he's, I, I didn't know who he was months ago. And now I'm just like, oh my God, I get a Shoji song. Like I'm so excited because <laughs> it's just, he's one of those. He's one of, to me, like in the top 10 of kind of all time. VGM composers. Everything he makes has... He's he's kind of up there with like the Koji Kondo thing with like everything they make is, is catchy and very memorable and just really nice to listen to. Koji from uh, Legend of Zelda and other games. I know this sounds kind of silly but this is what I do. I, I dissect little things that maybe other people don't care about but the way that intro started that was so cool. So cool that I'm going to play it again. I don't know when it was, I'm going to search it, but we're going to play it again. I, I love that. I loved just that. Seamless transition, which I believe it was the only time there were strings in the song, to then the other part just took over and the beat came in. That was so well done. We're basically just going to hear the intro again, up till about a minute. So we get an extra bonus minute, so kick back and let's just enjoy this again and <laughs> really try to focus on when that beat kicks in because that was smooth as hell. Oh, and the organ too was awesome. So it's just the intro right now. I think it's probably four bars of the intro. Yeah, we're just... he's just kind of playing. 
Okay, it starts here. That's the chord progression. But then you got those strings with it, and then they go away. One more. <laughs> That's so good. Okay, we have to stop. That that is so well done. For two reasons. One thing fades out and another thing fades in. The drums fade in. I love when percussion fades in. You never hear that. Think about it. How often do you hear percussion fading in? It's such a rare thing. So the fact that one thing goes away and the other thing takes its place, but it only starts with hi-hats like tick, 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 and then when it's fully gone, tick, 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 tick. so good. <laughs> so good. I am definitely going to be listening to this as part of my regular rotation of just cool songs. You might even hear it in the background of my, you know, all like when I'm talking, I always have background VGM. This will go in there. So for sure. That's an honor. <laughs> Because you know how many comments I get every day? What's the song in the background? That was great. Catherine, it's a golden show. It says game version in parentheses, whatever that means. So maybe there's another version. Ooh. Either way, I don't know what Catherine is. I kind of don't even care. I'm sure it's great. <laughs> I was just so focused on the song. Shoji is great. I, I, you know, I'm not going to lie. Whether I knew it was Shoji or not, I still would have felt the same way, but it's just the icing on the cake that I found out it's him before, right before I played the, the song. Bravo. Tell me more about Catherine. That's all I got. And as far as I know, this is the intro movie, so I don't think it plays during anything. So, yeah, again, very lucky <laughs> that people share this stuff with me. And you confide in my rambling and me just geeking out over music. I love I love music too. If you couldn't tell. If you want to make a request to me, you can do so on Patreon or PayPal. Either are totally fine. There's a guaranteed ways I will check out your song if you don't mind waiting. If you do not want to wait, there is the Platinum Trophy tier, which your average metalhead is a part of. A big thank you to Justin, Kevin, Moon Knight, DJ Singleton, and of course, your average metal for being a part of that. Thanks to all my other Patreon supporters. Thanks to you for watching. My name is Jesse. This has been the Auditorium. I will see you in the next one. That was tight. Peace.